Hi, today's problem is, assume that you made two individuals, heterozygous each for two traits, and obtained 80 offspring, how many of them would be expected to look like their parents? And this is a rather really simple problem, so I encourage you to stop video here, try to solve this problem on your own, and then you can run video again and you can compare your answer with my answer and explanation. And uh, here is my explanation. We told that we have to cross two uh, representative. Let's say, for example, this would be plants. It's much easier for me to use plants because I'm botany major. So, for example, we have two traits, and uh, one parent would be heterozygous for one trait and for the other trait. And we have to mate with uh, another parent that is also going to be heterozygous for both traits. So capital A small a and capital B small b. And we can solve this problem uh, with express method that doesn't involve uh, building a Punnett square with 16 cells because each um, such cross would produce, uh, each of such parent would produce four uh, types of gametes and 4 by 4 would be 16 so table would uh, have 16 uh, cells but we can solve this problem much easier we can we can take each pair of alleles separately find the frequency of the phenotypes and then we can multiply those frequencies and so we can find uh, the final answer so if we take uh, first allelic pair, that is capital A, small a, and if we cross with another uh, such pair, because both parents are heterozygous for this trait, and we are going to get capital A, capital A here, capital A, small a here, capital A, small a here, and small a, small a here. And as you see, three quarters, three out of four would produce the same phenotype as capital A small a. I include here two uh, that is exactly the same and I also include this capital A capital A because uh, phenotype would be the same and the question is uh, expected to look like their parents. The question is not about the same genotype, the question about the same phenotype. So that's why I include all this 3 out of 4 and this would be allelic frequencies if we cross this allelic pair with this one. Let's move and do the same for the second set of alleles and the results going to be of course the same so we would have capital B small b on one side and capital B small b on the other side and once again results would be the same we just cross two heterozygous parents for this uh, alleles and as you see once again this three out of four would produce same uh, phenotype as capital B small b so three quarters and now uh, we have to multiply three quarters by three quarters. This is chances that uh, uh, our phenotype for the first uh, set of alleles would be this one, three quarters. And this is uh, chances that uh, second set of alleles of the progeny uh, phenotypically would look the same as uh, here. So this is also three quarters. And we are going to get 9 out of 16. And now it's very easy. We just have to multiply 80 by 9 over 16. And the answer would be 45. And also um, three quarters we can uh, say that this is 0 0.75 or 75 percent so if you prefer to use percentages it would be uh, it would look like this 
we have to multiply 80 by 75 percent for the first uh, set of alleles A and also we have to multiply by 75 percent for the second set of alleles and the result would be the same 45 um, plants would look exactly like uh, their parents and if you were mistakenly uh, think that the question was about uh, the same genotype the answer would be uh, completely different so if the question were what how many um, plants out of 80 would have the same genotype in this case we have to solve this problem uh, differently so the same genotype for the allele A would be 1 out of um, 2 or 2 out of 4 is the same like 1 half and here also would be 1 half so uh, we multiply 1 half by 1 half and this is going to be 1 over 4 and then we multiply by 80 total number of plants and the answer would be 20 so uh, if the question would be uh, how many of the the offspring of the F1 generation would have the same genotype the answer would be 20 and if the question how many out of 80 plants of the progeny would uh, look the same or would have the same phenotype the answer would be 45 so this is my solution thank you for your attention please subscribe for my new videos that i post almost every day thumbs up if you like this video goodbye